Uh, uh, good morning, it's Jeff at Budrum here. Um, I just want to talk about shallots and spring onions. Now, for 10 years I've been growing shallots, and I didn't really realise I was growing shallots. I just didn't know what to call them, shallots or spring onions. So I just called them both at different times, uh, you know, shallots or spring onions. I didn't know. So uh, until I saw a cooking program towards the end of last year, a Vietnamese bloke was doing a show and and he was cooking, he, he cooked up some uh, shallots, he, he put them on and then he put on some spring onions and I thought, ah, oh, there's a difference. So I looked at a few videos on YouTube and then I discovered that uh, what I was actually growing was shallots and I realise now that there's a difference between shallots and spring onions. So I'd been using the shallots actually as spring onions and I didn't realise that all I had to do was just let them grow another month or another six weeks and they develop into these beautiful shallots. So um, just in front of me here I've got a couple of boxes here and uh, on my left there's uh, the spring onions that I planted before Christmas. I did a video uh, planting spring onions in a broccoli box. So that's the remainder of those. We've been using them all along you know, in cooking and and in this box I've got some um, French shallots that we got from a supermarket. So I planted uh, eight of those, but only four of them survived. So uh, I think I overwatered them. But anyway, I'm just going to see what develops from those. And uh, so uh, we'll, we'll, I'm going to uh, now. I did another video before Christmas, planting shallots in a broccoli box, and they're ready to harvest. I'm just going to uh, show what um, what we get out of that. We'll come back to that. Okay, well this is the, I think this is the box that we planted on our video uh, planting shallots in the broccoli box. So I'm just going to, as you can see the foliage is just about died, so I'm just going to um, plant, dig them up. We actually had had a box that we, we let um, get mature, uh, what I just said before, and uh, oh how fantastic. So that's off one plant, so you're just going to separate these. I, you know, I didn't realise actually what we had. So, uh, so, uh, so you just sort of separate all these uh, little onions. And uh, as they dry out, they form a little a, a thin skin on the outside. And, um, and then you can plant them back out again if you, when you're ready. So that's off one plant. Or eat them. Yeah, that's right. Eat them, that's right. So, but really, the amount that you've got to plant back out is only a small fraction, really, you know. So, uh, uh, if I sound excited, I probably am. <laughs> so that's, that's off, off two plants. So, um, now, now, seeing as we use shallots and spring onions in everything we cook, it only makes sense to devote, you know, four or five broccoli boxes to shallots and spring onions. So, um, you know, and you just use a bit of blood and bone and a bit of liquid fertilizer, and, you know, so it's very cost effective. And you can get the broccoli boxes at a real good price, uh, probably a couple of dollars each, or sometimes you can get them for free. So there's, that's the third one, I think. Yeah. yeah. There's another one. That's incredible. I, I, I just didn't realise what we were growing all these years. All I had to do was let them grow another four or five weeks. <laughs> and, uh, but we'll still be enjoying them. But I didn't realise the flavour they had too. It's just compared to just onions. So you know, putting them in the spring rolls and everything else. Uh, by uh, the time these condense down, there's a good ice cream dish. Definitely a big, good ice cream dish there. So, then we've got another box over there. This box here is empty. We haven't put, put anything in that one, but it's only for laziness, really. So, yeah, one more to go. Uh, that's 
Let's see our shallots. Some people call these shallots, but we call them shallots. There you go. How's that? Now, Wonderful. that's the other box. Well, there's a few uh, ones that came up. Now, that's um, another, this is another box I planted about the same time. So, um, you can see over here, on this side here where my hand is, you know, they're getting, they're quite big. Oh, so, wow. I'll, I'll let them get a bit more advanced while we're using up these ones. Oh, they smell nice. Yeah, oh, beautiful smell. Yeah, so, uh, Okay, we're just in some. Okay, so we're back inside now because the, it was getting a bit too windy outside and it was making a noise on the camera. So, just in summary, um, I just I washed those shallots and um, put the tops off them and just going to let them dry out. And uh, what we're going to use is the smaller ones first and then work our way up to the big ones. So, that's uh, we're pretty happy with what we've got out of one broccoli box. So, um, pretty pleased and uh, so we're going to plant some more out. And um, I hope I've been spot Okay, so well, uh, anyway, thanks very much for watching, and uh, I hope I've inspired somebody. So I'll catch you on another video. Uh, all the best. Bye. <laughs>